And Luke Gray is the uh, pole sitter. Coming around, nice easy pace. And the green light, we go racing. 83 car of Brock Armstrong on the outside, but it is Luke Gray who gets away. I think Shane Carlson is the uh, the 25 car, that is correct. It was the, there's two green cars there. 25 and the 11 of Josh Boyd. Carlson, the one on the outside. And trying to run through into second, second place. They are three wide out of turn four. That's an amazing sight. And the number 11 car of Josh Boyd up to second. Carlson third. And uh, putting the 83 car of Youngbury back into fourth place as they uh, now chase down Luke Gray it's still side by side action between the two green cars of Carlson and Boyd Boyd keeping the nose in front down the back straight oh bicycles it gets up on two wheels and the control is gone Boyd's bailing car number 11 Josh Boyd Runs around on the grass before entering the uh, the track again. But it's Luke Gray who now starts uh, picking off the slower cars. One of them pulls straight onto the grass. So Luke Gray, Shane Carlson, Brock Armstrong back there in the 83 car. Clearly a well away from the uh, number 11 car of Josh Boyd. At a big moment. Now we've got ourselves an amber light car on the grass that's the uh, 29 car Adam Grill Just waiting for uh, everybody to be in place. And hopefully we get a, a start next time round. We're starting to work his way through the slower cars. Now he's clear air. But Shane Carlson and Brock Armstrong right on his tail. Josh Boyd, who had a uh, fairly sizable moment that put him up on the grass before uh, re-entering the race. He's in fourth spot. LJ Gray in the 33 car tonight and then Jeff Campbell in behind him. Jeff Campbell in the number 13. As the light goes green, Luke Gray gets away. pressure now from Shane Carlton. Oh, Shane has a moment in turn two. The whole front twitched. As he tries to chase down Luke Gray, as many have tried in the past. Brock Armstrong gets on the inside of Shane Carlton, who's been getting a little messy out wide. And I think something must have gone in the car because uh, He's pulled up very, very slow, quickly, and is now running slowly around the outside. Yeah, so looking to head to the grass. It's Luke Gray, Brock Armstrong, and then back to Josh Boyd. Big gap though between uh, Gray and Armstrong. Six laps to go in our feature race for the street stocks.
Luke Gray with a couple of slower cars in front. He's got to pick his moment to get around. We'll just want to smoothly drive wide and uh, hopefully nothing goes wrong. Gets around one. Lines up the second. Coming out of turn four. That's the number three car he's got to get past of uh, Glenn Storick. It's allowed Brock Armstrong to get a little closer, but not close enough. Three laps to go. Luke Gray started the race out in front and hasn't been caught since. Luke Gray, Brock Armstrong. They're the two that are close enough. Brock Armstrong now. Close enough to make a move, if only there was the room. As they now have a whole bunch of slower cars to work their way through. And they will see the white flag this time round. Luke Gray sees the white flag, he's on his last lap. Brock Armstrong, right on his tail. Down the back straight for the last time. No mistakes to be made here. The winner is Luke Gray. Check and flag for the number five. Brock Armstrong and Josh Boyd second and third. It's 583 and 11. That is the way they finish. Great race from Luke Gray. And still go a guard as the checker flag falls for uh, some of the uh, the tail enders. But Luke Gray, magnificent race, class and experience shining through. Okay.